Hey, superstars, it's your best friend, Scott, and this is our March update. We have a ton to go over this month, including some predictions, some reindeer updates, uh, looking forward to Strongsville, a contest win, some amazing care packages, and a traveling box. But before we get into all that, today is a very, very special day for me. It is my fifth year anniversary here on YouTube, and uh, I probably don't have to tell you what this whole experience means to me, but I will anyway. Um, it really has been an incredible ride in every sense of the word, and uh, so many of you have been just awesome. Whether you started watching me last week or five years ago, I cannot begin to express the gratitude that I have for all the love and support that you guys give me every day. And it just means the world to me. And I don't know where I'd be without you guys. So thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Um, but enough sappy stuff. Let's do it to it. All right, it is time for Fox Crew Cards Annual Prediction Contest. I did horrible last year and I don't expect to do any better this year, but I do try to make an effort. So uh, let's see what the crystal ball says. AL East winner, it pains me to say the Yankees, so I'll go with the Orioles. AL Central winner, it also pains me to say it, but the Twinkies. AL West winner, this one's kind of tough, but I'll go with the Astros, I think. NL East winner, I'll go Braves. NL Central winner, this was tough too. I'll go with the Cubbies. Uh, NL West winner, let's say Dodgers. Um, more wins, Yankees or Mets. I'm going to go with Yankees. Blech. Uh, more wins, Cubs or White Sox. I'm going to go with the Cubs. AL home run leader is going to be Aaron Judge this year. Will the Angels make the playoffs? Nope. Number of wins by the Marlins, I'll go 79. Number of wins by the Pirates, uh, let's say 80. The National League strikeout leader will be Spencer Strider. How many games will Mike Trout play? I'm going to say 130. The All-Star MVP will be Jonah Heim. Number of innings pitched for Clayton Kershaw, let's say 58. Will Mike Trout reach 400 home runs this season? Um, I don't think so. How many games will Aaron Judge play? Let's say 140. How many errors will Mookie Betts make it short? Let's say 18. Which player will have the most wins for the Rockies? I'll go with my man Cal Quantrill. Who will have more wins, Max Scherzer or Nathan Eovaldi? I will say Eovaldi. Will Yandy Diaz get traded by the Rays this season? I uh, say no. Uh, number of wins by the Oakland A's, 47. And the two teams in the World Series are going to be the Orioles and the Dodgers. There you go, Fox crew. A little bit of mom spaghetti for you. All right, my bestie Donnie really wants to see some photos from our youth. I think me specifically, because he mentioned me quite a few times in his video about this. And he wants us to make fun of ourselves. Well, I mean, here's me, Prebeard, playing for my little league Dunkin' Donuts team. I was a lousy ball player, but I love playing nonetheless. And um, here's a 1991 Donruss card of Lil Scott. This was probably at a card show or a baseball game or something, I don't remember. Really couldn't find much of anything else, but uh, as far as making fun of myself, I mean, how? I was a pretty rad kid. So for March, my uh, big focus was my countdown to opening day series. Um, you can check that out if you haven't seen it already. But uh, because I spent so much time on the marker doodles, I really didn't spend any time um, designing any new t-shirts. So that'll be my big focus for April. And I've got a ton of ideas rolling around in this head and I'll be very happy to get those out of there. And speaking of t-shirts, if any of you guys are going to the Strongsville show and you would like to purchase a t-shirt or anything else from my Etsy shop in person without the cost of shipping or whatever, uh, let me know as soon as you can. I am planning on making a big order next week and I'd be happy to try to oblige. A link to the Etsy shop is in the description below as well as my email if you want to try to get a hold of me. Um, I'm really looking forward to seeing a bunch of you in Strongsville. It is going to be awesome. A few weeks ago, my bestie John P. Collects Cards had a giveaway, and I won an eBay gift card, which is super awesome because I'm doing my best not to spend any money on cards. I used that gift card to help pay for this 1955 double header signed by Joe Frazier and my man Don Mossy. The card is trimmed, and it's not the greatest signature, but it's there, and I've never come across one of these signed before, so awesome. Thanks, John. This is a package from my best friend Ed at Angry Old Man. Christmas cards in March. 
Those are the best. It says, Scott, my bestie, sorry I missed the holidays. I hope all is well, and I hope you enjoy this Jarrett Wright photo for your collection. Happy George Washington's birthday. All the best, your bestie, Ed. And Ed spoiled the surprise, but he sent along a very cool Jarrett Wright autographed 8x10. I've got very fond memories of this guy. Super, super cool. Thanks, Ed. This next one's from my best friend, Victor Negron. Hey, bestie, don't know if you have this Stadium Club Red Parallel, but I wanted to send it over your way. You're a BFF, Victor. I definitely did not have this Stadium Club Red Parallel, Bob Feller, and I definitely love it. That red goes great with his stripy socks. Thanks, Victor. That's awesome. This big old monster box is not really a care package, but it is Mr. Fisher Bikes traveling box. My bestie Jason started this project where he sent this box to another YouTuber and it goes from collector to collector and we all take cards out for ourselves and then we put cards back in. It's, it's pretty cool and I'm excited to get my hands on it this year. Here's a letter. I'm not going to read all that, but it says, let's go. I'll pull out what I want and I'll be right back. Three hours later. All right, I'm back. I dug through the box and I picked out what I wanted. I had to grab a Super Collectors Unite sticker. Here's my guy, Bo Naylor, on an Allen & Ginter Mini, an Allen & Ginter Shane Bieber with an A&G back, um, Estevan Florial rookie card. He made the Guardians roster coming out of spring training, and I met him at Guards Fest. Really nice guy. And I'm prospecting a little bit with a couple of future Hall of Famer Terry Francona rookie cards. The Indians traded Roberto Alomar to the Mets for this guy, Alex Escobar, and I didn't have his autograph, so I grabbed that one. Shiny purple Sam Henkes. This made me laugh. Uh, Tim Anderson adorned with Jose Ramirez. Watch out, Timmy. He's coming for you. They're fighting. They're swinging. Down goes Anderson. I was surprised that I did not have this pinnacle Jim Tomey, and I didn't have this big extra bases Manny Ramirez card. Lots of great stuff in there, and I put in lots of great stuff, hopefully. Uh, this was a blast. Thanks for getting this started, Jason, and thanks to everybody else involved. You might remember that last summer I finished up this Field of Dreams painting for Josh at Impact Player. It was kind of big, so I didn't really want to ship it, so we agreed to meet up, but it took a while to fit it into our schedules. So I recently got to meet up with Josh for lunch at Tony Paco's in Toledo for some chili dogs. And then Josh surprised me with this gorgeous autographed 53 Bowman Bob Feller that he bought from Joey Brings It. This card is just absolutely fantastic. So very, very cool. And it means so much that Josh would gift this to me. It's just amazing and so thoughtful. And I definitely cherish this one. Uh, thank you, thank you, thank you, Josh. I hope we get to hang out again soon, buddy. So that is it for now. Thanks to MP and MC and Don for the VRs. Thanks to John P. Collects Cards for the eBay gift card. Thanks to Ed at Angry Old Man, Victor Negron, Mr. Fisherbike, and everyone involved with the traveling box. Thanks to Josh Impact Player for hanging out. And thank you guys for watching and all of your amazing support over the last five years. Again, if you're going to Strongsville and you would like me to bring some t-shirts or whatever, reach out and I'll do my best. Now go find a better video to watch and we'll see you real soon.